took both sides half an hour to get into this match but it was Kamana who made the breakthrough Paul Wright's flick onto Gary Holt a couple of touches and the ball's in the back of the net a well what move between Wright and Holt and that goal giving Killy a crucial 1-0 lead Motherwell were determined to get the points to pull themselves clear of the relegation zone a collision here between Garsan and Lachlan giving Motherwell a free kick in a dangerous area Unfortunately, the Frenchman well off target with this effort. Harry Campman urged his side to get an equaliser and he was almost rewarded when Shivuti set up Tommy Coyne. No luck for Motherwell there, but Shivuti this time with another chance for the well. Gordon Marshall forced off the line, but also close. Still no equaliser though. Paul Wright was eager to put the game beyond reach for Killy and it almost came from a precision cross from John Henry. Good save by Stevie Woods and the mother will go. The weather may have changed but the outcome of this next chance for Paul Wright hadn't, failing to hit the target. Motherwell were back in this game after persistent second half pressure. Ten minutes before the end, sweet Stefan Lindquist scoring his first and most vital goal for the club. Relief for the players and the support who by now are braving terrible conditions inside Fair Park. A good cross. Some great control by Lindquist and a suggestion of maybe a deflection on the way into goal. The visitors almost snatched the points in injury time. Jerome Varai meeting Nevin's cross. Stephen Woods earning his wages. Wasn't a great game to watch for the spectators. In the end, it finished 1-1.